the acts of st paul and thecla the martyrdom of the holy and glorious first martyr and apostle thecla chapter seven paul and thecla go to antioch alexander a magistrate falls in love with thecla kisses her by force she resists him is carried before the governor and condemned to be thrown to wild beasts then paul sent back anesiphorus and his family to their own home and taking thecla along with him went for antioch and as soon as they came into the city a certain syrian named alexander a magistrate in the city who had done many considerable services for the city during his magistracy, saw thecla and fell in love with her and endeavored by many rich presents to engage paul in his interest but paul told him i know not the woman of whom you speak nor does she belong to me but he being a person of great power in antioch seized her in the street and kissed her which thecla would not bear but looking about for paul cried out in a distressed loud tone force me not who am a stranger force me not who am a servant of god i am one of the principal persons of iconium and was obliged to leave that city because i would not be married to thamyris then she laid hold on alexander tore his coat and took his crown off his head and made him appear ridiculous before all the people but alexander partly as he loved her and partly being ashamed of what had been done led her to the governor and upon her confession of what she had done he condemned her to be thrown among the beasts 